guys, it's Terry and Hearts, and I have the part two to the two part uh, haul that I put up. Um, and yeah, I kind of did it in a rush because I was literally going to work um, when I tried to do the part two part. So I hope you enjoyed as much as I tried to like explain everything that I got. Um, yeah, I hope you guys had an amazing holiday um, and Happy New Year's if I don't put up a video before that. Um, yeah, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, share, and again, if you don't like the video, just stop watching it and move on to somebody else's video. Like, you're not obligated to watch this video, so you, there's no reason for you to leave rude remarks in the comments below. Just keep it moving and keep the peace. That's all. Um, yeah, so I'll see you guys in my next video. And guys, leave your comments below. Tell me what you liked out the video. Tell me how you like the products if you have them. Let me know what you got. Just make it simple. Make it nice. Make it fun. Okay, guys, I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Hey, guys. So this is part two of my two-part haul and I just wanted to show you some stuff that I got from Sephora um, and also from BH Cosmetics so let's start with the Sephora I went to Sephora and I picked up a few things and um, these are things that I've always wanted to try and got the opportunity to pick them up so we're gonna start off with the the hourglass uh, veil primer and oh don't watch my fingers I need to get a manicure done and this stuff is so soft so silky it's amazing you guys and it just rubs right in and a little goes a really 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 long way it's so soft it's oh it's so amazing. I love this thing so much. And this is a small size and I got it for 20, $22 Canadian dollars. The other thing that I got, and it was in a packet, it was like, it's a $30 value. Well, more than $30. But um, I got the Kat, Kat Von D lip stick liquid lipstick and this is in the color um, Lolita that's what it looks like and I seriously love this thing it smells so amazing and it gives off the best color ever and then it dries matte so I really love this so that's the Lolita and I also got the little small sample size um, lipstick. And this is called the Berlin. And that is what it looks like. Okay. Isn't that beautiful? So that's the Kat Von D. I also went ahead and picked myself up the Makeup Forever HD foundation which I really wanted to try for a really long time and I got it in the 173 amber because that's my shade and I really love it I've used it and I will post a look of um, me using this foundation I really love it it goes on really nice easy to apply I use my um, my Real Techniques um, buffing brush I also got for Christmas. Um, I got the core collection set. So the Real Techniques buffing brush, the, uh, what is this, the contour brush, and I believe it's the foundation brush, foundation brush, and the lip brush, which is this right here. I'm sorry, it's a detailer brush. So, 
So I got these for Christmas, but I use this brush to apply my foundation. Um, it's real dirty right now because I did do my makeup for work yesterday. So this is the brush that I use to apply the Makeup Forever foundation. Or sometimes I just use my sponge, which is super dirty too because I used it yesterday. The bottom is clean. <laughs> so I use this under my eyes, the top part under my eyes. So, But yeah, I really love this foundation. It's amazing. Um, I'm having trouble... With the fact that it does make my t-zone my t-zone oilier than normal but um i'm also trying to find other things that i can use to um get the oil to stop pushing through i also use i also bought the makeup forever mist and fix um it's almost done as you can see um I use this um, when, to set my makeup, um, but it does make me oily. So if you have any um, suggestions on what I can use to not make my face oily, please, please, please leave it in the comment box below. I really, really, really need to find something that doesn't make my face oily. I've tried using this. I've tried using the powder, translucent powder. I've tried um, in Makeup Forever. I've also tried using the Urban Decay spray, but I still find that I get oily and it's ridiculous. So if you have, if you know of something that can take the oil away from my face, because I have normal to oily skin. Well, I have three combinations of skin. I have dry skin when I have active acne. I have um, normal skin when my face is clear but my t-zones are always 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 oily like they i feel the oil just dripping down on my face so if you know something that i can use to stop this oil please tell me i've tried urban decay and i've tried um makeup forever mist and fix and their translucent powder and it doesn't work so if you do have something you can recommend please tell me i would love to see it so that is it for the Sephora part of this haul. Stay tuned for the BH Cosmetics part. Bye, guys. So the next part of the haul is the BH Cosmetics haul with this box filled with goodies. And I'm going to show you exactly what each item in this box is. Okay, so let's start with this uh, 10 color palette glamorous blush set um i love the fact that it has so many different colors in it and this one color up here that can also be used as a highlighting color so this is what the palette looks like um you have your reds your pinks your purples or lavender you have your um, neutral tone colors. I use this one color up here as a highlight because it's so beautiful. You can hardly even see it when it rubs up. It's just highlighting. I love this palette. I have used this color and the red out of it for work yesterday because you know it was the day before Christmas and I just really wanted to put that Christmas spirit because we wore all black to work. We wear all black to work. So I wanted to put just a little bit of red flush on my cheek just for the day. So that is the BH Cosmetics 10 color palette glamorous blush palette. The next one that we have is um, the It's Judy Time palette. I am so in love with this palette that it is so ridiculous. I love everything about this palette. As you can see, I've been using this color here, this color, and this color, and this. It is just so beautiful. The you can create so many eye colors with this thing. It's just simply amazing. I really love it. She did a wonderful job with it. And I have been using this because I had to wait till the second package for BH Cosmetics come in in order to do this video. So, And I just pile them all into one box. So that is the It's Judy Time palette. She has the writing up here about everything. Love it. 
Next thing that I have is the liquid foundation from BH Cosmetics. Um, I am currently in the color M5 Golden Beige. This, first of all, I don't like the smell. Let's just say that. But this foundation works miracles, okay? I put it on and it looks as if I didn't, I didn't even put any foundation on my face. It is just amazing. I just have to get used to the smell. That's the only thing that I have to get used to. And this will work amazing. I have used a little out of it um, for work yesterday just to try it out. And I absolutely love it. Did not look like I have on any makeup on my, any foundation on my face. Amazing. And it comes with the pump. I know mine looks real ratchet right now. Sorry, I was rushing to work and all. But it comes with the pump. And that's really nice. Next thing that we have is the um, this little bag here. It came with two brushes and two lipstick that I had ordered. The first brush that I take out is the stippling duo fiber stippling brush. I think it's a synthetic one. Um, it's re I love. I haven't used it yet, plan on using it, but don't know when just yet. But I will definitely um, do a look using this brush and let you guys know. The second brush is the blending brush in which I am absolutely in love with. This little brush works miracles. It is amazing at what it does. Like I really and truly love this brush. And as you can see, it has the BH Cosmetics logo written on it right there. And so does the other brush. It is truly an amazing brush. Like my eyes. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna put up a picture at the end of this of what I wore yesterday and using that brush to blend out my shadow. So here we have two lipsticks. This one is a coral escape, and this one is berry bite. Okay, so let me just open this up. This is the Berry Bite lipstick. And I will show you what it looks like. Oh, this color right here, this one, that is what it looks like. And this is a Coral Intense, the one on top. I'll just pull out the Coral Intense so you can see it. That's what it looks like. So it's different from what's on my hand. Yes, I know, but it's it's re relatively close so I also I'm, I combined both packages that I got one from last week and the one from this week so I combined them both and this came in the other package this is the lip liners waterproof lip liners that I said I would get from BH Cosmetics I'll start with the first one just to show you what it looks like. And this one is the stripped. And I broke it as the let's just say I broke this trying it. Um and that's this color in the middle right here. That's what it is. All right, that's what it looks like. The other color um, the other color is Delight, and I love this color. I, It's so beautiful. That's what it looks like, and that red color right there, that is it. The last lip liner that I got is, I think, Peachy. Yeah, that's the name. Okay, open it up here. That's what it looks like. That's what it looks like. And it's this color right here. See it? Right. So that's what came in my other, my second shipment from BH Cosmetics. And they came in these boxes and in this the Ziploc bag thing going on here. 
Uh, the other thing that came in my second shipment was this uh, laptop. And it is my foundation and concealer 10 color palette. Um, I saw it and I decided that I wanted to get it because you know what? I've been trying to find a concealer that doesn't already make my under eye circles darker. So that is the box that came in. Came in a plastic. This is the case itself. And we're opening it up. Ugh, I always have a hard time opening up these pads. Comes with the plastic. I'll just put that there for now. And this is the palette itself foundation and concealer 10 color palette and this is a foundation and concealer too because they have the first palette which has like all the lighter colors in it this one has no I'm lying I think this one is the lighter colors and the other one is a darker colors the first palette is the darker colors I don't remember guys it's either the first palette is darker colors or the second palette is this is the darker colors and the other one is lighter don't quote me but I did know that I tried to get the lighter color one and this is it haven't used it yet because I just got it and again it comes with the little plastic thing put it in there and close it up back it has a snap thing right there you just open it from there now let's move on to what came in my original pop um, box that I got a couple years now along with the um, blush palette this also the blush palette and the it's um, beauty time palette that came in my first box this also came in my first box and it is the 88 color palette and um, it's the matte eyeshadow one and I decided I'd go for this because then I'm not too much of a shimmery person and the It's Judy Time palette gave me all the shimmer that I needed. Um, so, came in the box, came with a plastic. Let me show you. Came with this plastic in it. Um, this is the palette, the outside of the palette. You can see my fingerprints all over it and everybody who was trying to touch it up. Um, this is the palette. I'm going to open it up so you could see. Oh! Okay, guys, I do not like opening up this one, especially if you don't have nails. And mine's right now are soft. But um, it has the mirror at the top with the two little sponge applicators. And these are the colors. Isn't that amazing, you guys? Look at that. Yeah, you have your dark brown and your, I think this is a matte black. Yeah. This is just amazing, and I love this palette, and um, plan on using it a lot. So that was it for my BH Cosmetics slash Sephora palette. I will put a Sephora um, purchase. I will put a picture of what I wore, the makeup that I wore to work at the end of this video on Friday the 23rd of December. Today, this video is being recorded on the 24th, which is Christmas Day. I just want to say Merry Christmas to you all. This is my little tree because it's just me and my husband. So this is just my little tree that we have going on here. Um, I just wanted to say Merry Christmas to you and your family from me and my family. And I do hope you have an amazing holiday. Be safe. Spread the love, the joy, the peace, the happiness, the laughter. And I love you so much, guys. The first Noel the angel did say was to certain poor shepherds in fear.